Okay, guys. So the next step of this is we've got we got our cases charged. Um, I write down what I charged all my cases at. So in this case, we started at 41.7. We ended up at 43.7. Like I said, I might be pushing the powder charge just a little bit too hard. The minute I see ejector marks, I stop, right? Just stop and I'll pull the rest of those bullets. But it's easier to load them now until I can figure out where my pressure is. And then I'll just stop and come back and pull them all instead of having to make two trips. So I'm shooting the, the 110 grain Sierra Match King. What I do now is, right now I'm not shooting for accuracy of, a, of the group. I'm shooting to find my lowest standard deviation and extreme spread. And so my, in order to figure that out, I'll shoot five shots at a time over a conograph with the powder charge. All seating depths will be exactly the same. We'll go back and do the seating depth test next. So I just got it at the 280 that this cartridge called for. What I do is I, I give it a little push and I turn it and I, I finish it off. So what I'm trying to do is, I don't know if this is a myth or not, but what I'm trying to do is just give it a little turn every once in a while so that hopefully it goes in symmetrical as it goes down. So I, that's all I do. I don't, I don't just close it down. I give it a little bump, a little bump and just keep spinning it. And then I, I go through and I'll do all of mine so the seating depth is exactly the same. It's all the exact same whenever I'm shooting. And I'll go through and just load every one of these. And, uh, and then tomorrow morning we'll go out and we'll shoot them all. And we will actually write down everything that we're doing. So this will be the last video that I do today. And just so you can see, I've got the, uh, I've handled that case a lot. I've got the 41.7s on there, the, the round is seated, and I've made sure that the round goes into my rifle. And so what I do whenever I'm checking a loaded round on my rifle is I put it on safety, and I just put it in there, and then I slowly close the bolt on it, open it up, close the bolt, bring it back down, catch it, and I make sure that I'm not in the lands or grooves, and on this one I'm not. And second thing I do is I, I just put it in the magazine to make sure that it'll fit inside the magazine. And that's where I start my seating depth test. Um, sorry, that's where I start my seating depth test. From there, we'll, we'll go up or down based off of what our accuracy tells us after we find our node. Anyway, so uh, yeah, next time you see us, we'll be out on the range. Ponder on it. <laughs>